Hi, my name is Adam Clore. I manage the Synthetic Biology Design and Support Group here at IDT. And I'd like to talk to you guys today about two new products that we're launching in our GBlox Gene Fragments family. To start out with a little history, we've, we launched GBlox Gene Fragments a little over two years ago. And since that time, our customers have used them for a variety of different purposes. They've used them to construct genes, to construct operons. They've also used them for qPCR template and for uh, controls in next-gen sequencing. I'm really excited today to announce two new products that we have. The first is a longer G-Block. We're now able to make G-Blocks up to one kilobase in length. It's the same fidelity and the same quality that you came to know with our smaller G-Blocks, just longer. The second, and I think the most exciting product that we have, is G-Blocks libraries. These libraries allow customers to put mixed bases within their G-Blocks. Currently, we're limiting the mixed bases to Ns and Ks, but you can have up to 18 Ns or Ks within your sequence. My group is also working to design custom libraries for our customers, so if you guys have any special projects you'd like to work on, any ideas that you'd like to try out, my group would be happy to help you design those.